Coming to you live from the Traders Expo here in Las Vegas, I'm joined by Thomas Key, founder, CEO, president, Stock Traders Daily. Thank you very much for joining me, Thomas. Thank you. So let's talk a little bit about this liquidity crisis you've been telling me about. What do you, how do you feel about this? Uh, well, we're currently in a liquidity crisis, uh, as far as I'm concerned, in the U.S., uh, for a couple reasons. Uh, one, based on demographics alone, my macroeconomic work is called the investment rate, and it tells me where natural demand cycles exist. Stimulus has inflated demand, and it's not where everyone thinks it is, because stimulus is no longer flowing into the economy. So as a result, the economy is going to revert back down to the mean, to the natural conditions, which are defined by the investment rate, and that's substantially lower than where demand levels have been. So there's number one. There's a second part of this. Second part of this is margin levels. Margin debt levels on an institutional basis have skyrocketed, but a better look at that is the cash ratio to margin debt is at an all-time low, suggesting that institutions don't have much money to allocate anymore towards equities, which influences that liquidity crisis theory even more. So what I'm getting from this, uh, to break it down for me at home, is it's not good. This isn't good for the stock market. It's not good for the stock market at all. Uh, in fact, I, I think the risk of material decline exists. There is a catch, though, and the catch is that we're in the third year of a presidential cycle, and traditionally this is a good year. Yeah. And so do I think it's going to happen today or next week? Not necessarily. I think it takes a little bit longer. Into 2016, that all changes because we're set up today for a market crash. We are. Mm -hmm. But we're in this third year of a yeah. presidential cycle, and it's kind of hard to argue with that. So we need to have some sort of a flexibility in our observations, uh, and I do. Uh, but I think 2016 is going to be a horrible year for the market. So it's basically this ticking time bomb. What will be the trigger that tells you, okay, it's now time to get out of the market or, or raise cash or, or go short, whatever it might be? Is there something that you're looking for to trigger that? I, I can tell you something that will accelerate it for sure, but I think the triggers have already, already come to tell you to be proactive and manage risk. Does that mean to put your tail between your legs? No, it doesn't. That means to be proactive, take advantage of upsides when there exist and downsides when that exists as well. Um, so that proactive approach okay. is what we're adopting. However, if they raise rates in the face of an already potential liquidity crisis, that's going to accelerate the entire equation and we're going to see even more of a rapid decline. Oh, Janet Yellen, it's on your back, Thomas says. Thank you very much. Be prepared. 2016, rough year. Thanks, Thomas. <laughs> Thanks.